Domino the same objectives are being pursued by Ethereum. Both networks want to improve the world, but in the process of doing so, they get mired in the same kinds of issues. Not just Cardona is experiencing a severe decline in both pricing and statistics with the introduction of the Vessel hard fork. Following the deployment of the merge, Ethereum is also experiencing periods of market turbulence. Which network will experience the biggest price spike? As a potential investor, it is tough not to be enthused after carefully examining Cardano's fundamentals. The market discourse is dominated by social media, and in this paradigm, an undervalued asset is equivalent to the achieved per unit price. ADA is now worth one penny. It is not good enough and you are probably not interested in Cardano and Ethereum's position on improving the world if your motivation for investing in cryptocurrencies is to become rich quickly. No investment offers a guarantee of returns, and as you are aware, the cryptocurrency market is the most volatile of all markets. Although there have been incredible jumps, Cardona is still a good deal. Additionally, we have experienced considerable decreases. The overall crypto market does not have enough historical data to determine whether it has the potential to stable and produce profits over the long term. However, there have been people who have used the money to gain thousands or millions of dollars as returns, and they were simply incredibly lucky. Ethereum does not have it easy. It initially ran across the similar issues that the Cardano network is currently facing. It was introduced in July 2015 and first traded for $2.77 on August 7th. The following day, the coin's value dropped to $0.81 cents and stayed below $1 until January of 2016. The most challenging aspect of cryptocurrencies and other emerging assets is that, had they had the benefit of hindsight, many investors would have purchased Ethereum or Cardano years ago, just as some would have done with Amazon when its IPO price was only $18 per share. The focus was not on long-term investments, though. But with Cardano, it's really simple to invest for the long run in a project once you have a firm grasp of its fundamentals. It is gambling, not investing, if all you're doing is hoping it will turn out to be the next great thing. Try to describe it from a long-term perspective, whatever you choose to do. Nobody wants to be in debt three months from now because they gambled on cryptocurrency and lost everything. The primary query at this point is, will Cardano ADA reach $10 a coin? It actually depends, though. There are several things to take into account. However, analysts believe that it's poised to reach $10 sooner than most people believe. The price of the ADA coin is significantly impacted by Cardinal's capacity to permit stable coins to be produced and sustained on the platform. Through upholding the coin's worth and importance, its value is also increased by the ADA network. This is achievable since the coin's value is correlated with network performance. When the demand for the ADA stablecoin soars, the ADA network is able to support investors' tremendous interest in stablecoins and stable pairs. Additionally, Cardano will be under more pressure, driving up its price. Additionally, it has created a strong network and a bright forecast for itself. Market trends and economic factors have been restricting Cardano's potential as an investment. Because of this, having unreasonable expectations can lead to unimaginable losses and unbearable suffering. Cardano unveiled its Vessel Hard Fork upgrade at the end of September with the intention of making it simpler for other projects and dApps to develop on the blockchain. Although there were no appreciable price increases associated with the upgrade, many experts are still confident that it will ultimately result in a considerable improvement to the procedure. However, the vessel modification was not as successful as was anticipated in terms of adding value quickly. Furthermore, in accordance with Andy Lyon, a chief digital advisor and the author of NFT from Zero to Hero, this failure can be traced to the global financial unrest, macro risk, driven by a very hawkish U.S. Fed, has also weighed on price movement following the launch of the vessels. He claimed that during the excitement leading up to the split introduction, the ADA Bitcoin exchange rate also fell by 5.5%. This phenomenon was related to broader macroeconomic issues brought on by a problematic global economy and a protracted bear market. 
Donald was not the only toy affected by macroeconomics. Macro forces do not care about updates or future commitments. Ethereum also received its fair share. However, Cardano is making an attempt to alter the world for the better. Users continue to have faith that Cardano will quickly advance. Donald's objectives go well beyond just leveraging the blockchain to decentralize transactions. There are many goals out there that are unquestionably superior to pure greed, particularly in the financial markets. There are rival cryptists that are only interested in fame and the goal to increase their crypto worth more quickly and significantly than any other. Scale is the true problem with all cryptists, though. It is regarded as the creative proving ground where theories are developed and tested. Many financial institutions and businesses are only now learning about cryptocurrencies and how DeFi can be used to their advantage. Given this, it is easy to assume that Cardano has admirable goals. To put it another way, the idea of cryptos, like Cardano, highlights the promise for what cryptocurrencies and DeFi could bring to the world's financial system. Really, this is amazing stuff. The crypto market is, however, constrained by fragmentation going forward. It will be challenging for Cardano to establish the framework that would enable its ambition to become a worldwide reality, which is influencing the coin price if the nature of decentralized currencies does not let it to be more organized. The cryptocurrency market may appear to be too new and unstable for any investor to generate any significant profits. However, Cardano ADA is what sets it apart. It has a worthwhile vision that is worth embracing. The vision has also drawn a number of bullish reports. Cardona is currently one of the biggest proof-of-stake blockchains in the world based on electricity use and market worth, according to a White House Energy report. This report generally aims to investigate how the crypto space affects climate change. It also examines if the government will need to implement any reforms to lessen the environmental impact of the Bitcoin industry. Cardona came up at number one on the proof-of-stake front and third overall in the White House ranking of all cryptocurrencies. Supporters and neighbors of Cardona were energized by this report. On Twitter, Cardona has received a lot of support, which is positive. Dan Gordillo, the creator of the Crypto Capital Initiative, also tweeted about this development. Here is a study from the White House Energy Department demonstrating Cardona as the biggest proof-of-stake blockchain in the world, most likely something called ADA. The MVRV ratio has also been continuously rising, acting as a bullish future signal. In order to advance Cardano and develop blockchain technology as a whole, a number of methods have been established to guarantee the greatest outcomes. Cardano was created as a mission-driven initiative and cannot technically fail because the greater adoption would put more people at danger. It grows gradually yet effectively. Of course, there must be a wide range of dissatisfactions with the speed of progress. Some even said that the launch of proof-of-stake will never happen, however Cardano refutes this claim. But do you really need innovation to compete? Yes, there really isn't any other option. It is important to remember that innovation happens in all initiatives, including those that are reluctant to do so because they feel it is not necessary. The goal of evolution is to find the optimal means of survival, including Cardano. ADA is moving in this direction, improving productivity and seeking out new possibilities. The fact that Cardano is the first proof-of-stake platform to be founded on pure evaluation, research, and development of evidence-based methodologies is not surprising. Donald beats Ethereum to the punch. However, its low price and a few utilitarian rights are insufficient to support a position in ADA. Cardano ADA $10 has a valid argument, according to Coinpedia. Only a few months later rather than many years. And let's face it, a that's crazy target. But to believe that Cardano ADA would reach $100 by the end of the year is absurd. So the $10 projection is not completely out of the question, but it is feasible to see at $10 or even higher. However, before you get too happy, you might want to consider what it will mean. Do you believe that if Cardano ADA...